We wake up 24th of February in Kiev at 5 o'clock in the morning from the sounds of bombing. We took our five-year-old son to the bathroom because there is no windows here and it cannot be cut. We didn't believe that war started, but our friend called to us from Veselkiv and he said that Russians now are bombing Veselkiv airport. So we decided to leave Kiev and we moved to our uh, parents' house in the small town near Gastomel. We were thinking that it will be more safer here, but it was a big mistake actually because Russians started the invasion exactly from this Gastomel. So we left there, this place, in the same day. My parents didn't want to leave their house and they stayed here. Uh, then after a few days, uh, the house near there was bombed and burned uh, down. So they realized that they have to leave or they will die here. So they evacuated at the last moment. Hopefully they have this opportunity because many people from Bucha and Gastomil couldn't evacuate in time. And from the first beginning of the war, we obtained a lot of uh, uh, letters from my colleagues, which offered a help and safe place to stay but I didn't want to leave my country, my husband, my parents. But the news was awful, actually. Uh, Russians were bombing uh, peaceful cities, uh, schools and kindergartens. And in the occupied uh, territory, uh, they were killing civilians, women and even kids, small kids. So I understand that I have to um, have to take my son to the safe place. The war has a catastrophic effect on science of Ukraine. Russian army is destroying the research infrastructure of Ukraine. They bomb our universities, our research institutions, and uh, many of uh, buildings are damaged. And uh, of course, equipment are destroyed. But the worst thing is that students, researchers, and uh, teachers are died every, every day. And uh, these losses cannot be recovered. From the beginning of the war, we feel the support of uh, uh, government of uh, European Union and from United States and from the citizens. Actually, I think it is um, uh, this uh, international support help us uh, to fight, to resist such, such a huge uh, country as Russia. So we feel not that we are not alone. So it's amazing and uh, I think that every Ukrainian uh, feels this support.